rest and enjoy view for a bit. Rest and enjoy view when we out of here. Yeah, we can definitely do that. So what's over here by any chance? Let's check. Battle command, huh? It must have sensed our I guess we can deal with some of the enemies here. Shouldn't be too bad. We're only attracting two of them instead of the entire room inside there. I'm surprised they can't even see us. We are fighting out here, you know? We are kind of, you know, fighting out in the hall here. I think they'll be, you know, pretty uh, angry at us. Not to boast, but that was spectacular. Right, Grunts? Remember, Rex? Pride comes before a fall. So that takes care of that. Wonder if I can go all the way around to the other side there, deal with some of the mobs. Yeah, I can. Okay, good. This okay. guy's just chatting here Time by himself to, to a table. Down. He's like, I'm just, I'm just trying to talk out a book here. Clearly, he just wants to talk out his thoughts before he can write it down in a, a letter or something. I don't know. My thoughts exactly. For an alpha prototype, you sure pack a punch, puppy. Puppy actually feature complete, but Masterpon want to keep tweaking UI. Okay, let's go for that. Uh. Let's show him a thing or three. We'll go for that guy, level eleven. We we'll deal with him first before we go inside there. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me about that. Okay, there we go. We should be able to take care of all of them at a time. That guy kind of blocking there. That's kind of unfortunate. This guy is going to be no problem, though. Hell yeah. And let's go for that heat. Nice. The damage. Hell yeah. Go for that hit again. Nice. Oh hell yeah. Why do you speak as you do, Poppy? Poppy speak normally. Why others have so many extra words? Yeah, I know, right? Words are difficult. Words are tough. Okay, time to take you down. I guess we're not gonna chase that guy. Maybe we don't have to. Can we fight this guy through the glass? Oh, we can, can't we? What? This game's physics are insane. I swear. How we're killing through this, I will never know. But hey, whatever. Let's just go ahead and assault them. Shall we? Let's do it. Well, it's upper hand, but it'll be fine. We'll be alright, we'll be alright. Just go ahead and hang on to this. Just fine. We got Nia healing us, so we should be A-OK. -okay. And, you know, uh, Tora is pretty defensive here, so she'd be good. Good. Nice. Nice, good. See if we can make it up to the second level here. Might be able to. I'm gonna stick with the combat and everything. Almost there, we're almost there. Nice, it's hopeless. He's good. Alright, good, good, good. Let's keep going with this. Nice. Stone, good for him. Ho ho, look at that. And finish off with some heat here. Nice. Oh my god. So good. So good. So good. Oh. I mean, the combat kind of, you know, is slow paced in its own regard, but it's not bad. I actually really like the pacing for it right now. <coughs> so, what can we go through here? We could probably go this way to charge up the platform or whatever. Yep, looks like it's something we've got to do. Probably doesn't work with a key, huh? Gotta get to lower area, huh? Ooh, this way might actually help us out. This way might work. Can we go down this way? Is that it? Yeah, there we go, that's it. <clears throat> that's what we gotta get to.
See the icon floating over there? It indicates the location of a heart-to-heart -heart talk. Heart-to-heart -heart are uh, important events that let your party members grow closer together as friends. You'll run into those icons all over Alres. It's a good idea to check on them as you encounter them. Yep, our buffs are kinda gone. To view a heart-to-heart, -heart, you need to have the right people present in your party at the right time of the day. You can view the conditions by accessing the icon. More heart-to-heart -heart view, the bond of trust and affinity between you and your blades will deepen. Good, alright. Should keep that in mind. Oh, that's gonna let us go down. Okay, sweet. Good. Nice. Alright, let's deal with the enemies before we have a little heart to heart. Let's show them a thing or three. Mm-hmm. There we go. But yeah, regarding power, we need to upgrade her critical ability significantly. If she benefits from crit, you know, we get we have to just keep buffing that as much as we can. Ooh, that item over there looks really good. Let's pick that up. Red thread, not bad. High rarity. Let's try this here. What do we get? The inside of a Titan battleship is way different from a Monocera, sir. What is Monocelos? Rex, you saw it, right? More did appear back in Goldmouth. Jin and Co's black boat. Ah, that really impressive one. It runs without being hooked up to a Titan, right? I know expert, but yeah, looked like it. Sound awesome! Tora want to see too! You won't get the chance, unless we see those Torna guys again. Fair, fair, fair. Tora changed mind, no need to see. <laughs> Master Pawn changed mind at Drop Up Hat. Well, the Minoceros was pretty sweet, but this is nothing to scoff at either. Music got louder there for a little bit, that's weird. For sure. It's full of things I've never seen before. Ah, that's because this vessel is result of latest breakthroughs in our daily tech. Regular folk never so much as set foot on board. You say breakthroughs in technology, but what you mean is salvage stuff, right? Um, not exclusively. I see lots of homegrown improvements as well. Like this, see? Whatever they've stuffed in here, it's been messed with so much, I can't tell what it was to start with. That control panel, it transmits signal to Titan nerves. By running cables to different parts of Titan from here, can control signal flow much more better. What? That's amazing. And this cable itself have 2.4 times the speed and 12 times the capacity of previous iteration. Mm. In other words, it on whole other level to stuff other countries use. Ah. So if they put this in a smaller Titan vessel, it would work even better. Pinpon, correct. <sighs> they seem to be having fun, but it's all gibberish to me. Poppy, what do you think? What should Poppy say? That's not even so bad. Why Master Pon acts so proud? Uh Master Pon acts so proud? Why Master Pon acts so proud? <laughs> Tora, very glad you ask. That because tech used in this Titan battleship is same as what Poppy's muscles and drivetrain use. Oh. Poppy is surprised. But however though, ones that Poppy use are even more improved than these here. Yet more surprised! <laughs> <laughs> Are you saying you stole the tech from Mora Day? Come on, Tora. Is that what you call sporting behavior? Tora take calculated risk in service to cause of scientific advancement. As a result, not even Ardanian scientists capable of reverse engineer puppy systems. Damn. So, no worries there. Upon learning secret of Poppy's birth, Poppy feels a sense of unease. Uh, everything fine. Probably. Wow. Now, Rex Rex, no time for chit chat. Let's get going. <laughs> Poppy's really quirky, isn't she? Hard to heart, ordained technology complete. That was kind of cute. That was pretty cute. Hello. I'm gonna walk away. You better not turn around. So, enemies do respawn, apparently. Alright. Noted, duly noted, that enemies do seem to respawn in this place. In, I guess, most areas where enemies will respawn. Weird game mechanics, but hey. There we go. 
and we should be able to escape through here. Although part of me kind of feels like we should just continue exploring the ship for a little bit more. Still so much we haven't seen yet, you know? So it might be beneficial for us to explore a little bit. See what we can find, possibly. Perhaps. Oh, hi Doggo. Now we're taking any dog for now. There we go. Thank you can take me. I missed the combo. Thank you can take me. That's the combo that I need. There you go. That's perfect. Thank you can take me. As we keep here. And boop. I'm getting good combo on the heat on the uh heat and stuff. It's really good. Getting a really good hang of it so far. Can't get up here, huh? Okay, that's the hangar. All right. What's gonna be happening out here then? Oh, more soldiers. No. Okay. Big more fights. That's fine. Thank that's a okay. Get yeah, big more fights, no problem. There we go. Thank you can take me. And finish it off with uh, done. We need an in really badly. We'll probably have so much reserve experience. So much. Anything here? A couple soldiers there. What's that gonna take us over to? It's gonna take us over to just a long hallway. There was something there. Starboard balcony? Oh yeah, there was a starboard balcony. Should we explore starboard balcony a little bit more? I feel like there might be some sort of treasure there. Let's do it. Let's take it on. Okay, Let's go with big guy here, the sergeant first. This is going to be useful to go explore the place as much as possible, right? I mean, all this seems to make sense. Nice. There we go. So sweet. Power of friendship, exactly. Power of friendship, that's how we defeat everything here. Alright. Oh. Yeah, probably don't want to be dealing with that. Probably don't want to be messing with that. Let's just go ahead and avoid that for now. Now I realize that what we we're going to, we we're going to be fighting a level 13 enemy. Maybe best we don't uh, prod them. Yeah. Maybe best we don't. Uh, let's just make our way out of here then. Probably best we don't uh, overextend our abilities here. Pass those enemies, we can just go ahead and avoid them for now, no reason to fight them. Let's go ahead and make for an exit here. I feel like we're gonna have a boss fight here, so just in case, let me go ahead and uh, save if you don't mind. There you go. Alright, now here we go. further to exit not so fast my dear intruders letting a terrorist from Torna out of my grasp would make me look very bad indeed oh that emerald core crystal you must be the Aegis much as it pains me to admit it it seems Borad was right on the money you know who power is are you trying to capture it too, you rat bag? No, no, language. But of course. The most powerful blade in all of history, with the power to rend all rest asunder. Only a fool would know of that power and not seek to claim it. And I am no fool. Therefore, I will claim her as my own. You cannot argue with such logic. Law detected in final step of logic. Sorry, pal, but you've done all the capturing you're gonna do today. Such impertinence for a dirty terrorist. Let's go, Hyra. Got it. All right, are we just finding him? And we're finding also his uh, ally here. You got ourselves a decent sized party, it's worth knowing how to deal with aggro. Dare say you've already noticed, but while a driver is being attacked by an enemy, they will mark with a red ring. 
We call this the aggro marker. The wedges on the marker point to the targeting enemy or enemies shown direction being attacked from. Aggro is a measure of an enemy's aggression towards the driver they are fighting. The more viciously you attack an enemy, the more want to attack you back. Drone aggro is dangerous to healers since they have low HP, they are more likely to be incapacitated by attacks. They should keep Nia's aggro low. Drivers that have defense-oriented classes are better equipped to draw aggro to absorb enemy attacks, so right now it's better for Tora to have the most aggro. Drivers with uh, fighter-type classes are the ones that focus on dealing damage to the enemy. That's Rex, so make him the mainstay of your offense. Uh, here's a cheat sheet. Defenders take the hit, healers heal defenders, and fighters hurt the enemy. I know what the trifecta is, I play MMO's hello. Well, now you know about aggro and drive classes, that's two things to keep in mind while you're given don't go what for. Alright, are we dealing with both him? Oh no, we're dealing with just him. You just have to worry about him. Okay, let's go ahead and get second from back here. We have a nice uh, attack range here. We'll build up uh, to a level 3 attack for us. Oh, we're gonna have to go up to him then. Now I've got three people on your team, I'll give you a quick primer on ceiling effects or blade combos. Take a look at the indicator of the arrow pointing to. They sh uh, these show the various ceiling effects can be applied to if you execute a stage 3 blade combo. Find a spe uh, special use in a blade combo will determine which ceiling effect is afflicted depending on a combo route. Once afflicted, a ceiling effect will continue until it gets all written by another seal. Regarding your types, sealing your uh, enemy uh, puts you at a massive advantage, so you should go all out and try to hit home with a stage 3 play combo. However, there's a, all, one drawback to be aware of. When you hit an enemy with a stage 3 play combo, they'll acquire resistance to the combo element. When that happens, an orb signaling the resistance will appear around the enemy. These are called element orbs. Attack the enemy with the same element as the orb and you'll do greatly, re and you'll do greatly reduced damage. Means using the same combo route repeatedly would deal much less damage. When you use blade combos, you should experiment with different routes. Okay. I'll tell my very best with that. I guess. Okay. Oh, it stops already? Are you kidding me? Yeah, they can feel pain. Okay. This, this guy, this freaking guy. All right, I'm getting right on them. No, 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 no. We think going, huh? We think going too. God, this guy sucks because of one to one everywhere. I hate him already. I hate him already. Come here, come here, come here. No, 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 come here. Stone. There you go. There we go. I think we didn't do some other damage on him. Except on that, what's going on? Something we can't do much damage with. There we go. Good. God, this guy just runs away everywhere, doesn't he? What a wimp. What a wimp. Get some healing out of him. Good. Good thing he got some healing. Thought needs to heal a little bit. As much as he can. Good arts plus. We're doing alright. Oh boy. God, this guy sucks. I really hate Duggo. I hate his um play the most though. Good. Okay. Okay, we got level 3, level 3 volcano. We got this now. Come on, Jesus. Let's do this. There we go. Let's shoot us some damage on him, right? Hopefully. Volcano topple. Oh, shit. 
All right, looks like we're doing good. Let's go chase him a little bit. All right, looks like we're doing okay. Looks like we're doing okay here for now. Come here, buddy. God, this guy sucks. You know, I'm about to go ahead and go for win here for a little bit. This guy sucks. I hate. I hate his attacks. I really hate his attacks. Let's go ahead. I'm gonna go full out attack. Let's go full out attack. There you go. Nice. Good knockdown. We need to heal my Dombi. Yeah, we need to go ahead and rest Mike. Up, up. There you go, Tora. Let's go for the win attack here. We did well. We healed through that. So I guess we did something. Oh, there he is. I hate this guy that runs around so much. What a subtle bitch. What a subtle bitch, dude. What a subtle bitch. Pouch expansion I will take. I got a rare cool crystal. We just got a rare cool crystal. Oh, a mangy flea bag and a bunch of stinking kids. I triumphant return to more Arden with the Aegis. Oh. Out like a light. That's what he gets for trying to execute Nia. What? He was trying to take me back to more Arden. Rex, this is a trap. A trap? So they weren't actually going to execute you? No time! Talk later, Rex Rex. We should escape! Master Pawn is right. Chance of reinforcements very high. Let us make haste. A getting out of town would be a good start. Well then, yeah, let's just go ahead and get out of here. We did get a rare crystal. I'm gonna have to see if I can interact with that a little bit here. Oh god. I feel like this is not gonna be over. Let's save here. Do you wanna attempt to try test out the crystal? Let's try it, I guess. We, since we have it and everything. Let's see if we can bond a blade to Rex here. It is a rare core crystal. 